it's been a few days since I really got the work done on this thing. But uh, interesting development. The uh, gentleman who put the windshield in the other day, uh, yeah, the day, same day I cracked it, um, he already purchased, an, or uh, ordered, not purchased, a new windshield, and he said he would, called us yesterday saying he was ready to put it in. Well, we hadn't really planned on putting it in just yet. We were going to wait till uh, we got this a little more ready for paint, because, you know, this just, for, for this just needs some uh, clear coat right here. And this is good. The roof itself we can paint. Remember, all I was trying to paint was this stuff here. I could shoot some clear coat over it. Just cover up everything. Shoot some clear coat over certain spots. Not that, not so much that. Just so it'll, just so that'll be fine and good to go. And I won't have to worry about scratching it and getting paint coming off. <clears throat> but, um, anyway, so since he's going to do that, I'm going to go ahead and put the trim ready to be put on. He said he put the trim on for us. Mm -hmm. That's my dad's new table, little rolly work table. You fold it up, you roll it around, you, and then you fold it, and you unfold it, you put it down, and you work on it. It's really cool. Anyway. Uh, hang on. There we go. Y'all may remember the other day I was working on this. I put that there to fill up a hole. Now I gotta sand it down smooth and repaint this thing, and this should be done. Should be. I mean, it will be. Um, and uh, I'm uh, after I'm working on this part here. I'm going to work on the door seal, I mean the roof rail seal, put the window felts on, the driver and passenger side, or driver and passenger, and then I'm going to get my uh, new stuff I have to seal the windows. Instead of using black silicone, I got some special window sealant, which is actually clear, and it's easier to move. But I can find it, I don't know where I put it, but anyway, <clears throat> I'm going to try to seal the windows with that, and if all goes well... Um, I should be able to park this outside, maybe today or tomorrow. Well, yeah, tomorrow, obviously, because you got to put the windshield back in it. Anyway, so, um, I'm going to have it this part right here. Um, and then I'm going to try to work on the seal. Okay, let me go see if I can find Mr. Pod. Y'all can watch. All right. Stand by. some uh, gray scratch filler primer over it after I put some tape on this and I'm pretty much going to go just this spot with the gray filler primer and the rest of the stuff that I fixed the other day is already scuffed I'm ready for paint it's a little warped but you know it ain't, it ain't a show car okay here we go all the tape I got
Okay, well, um, this stuff dries here enough that I can fix it because I don't know how well you can see it, but I didn't feather the edge on these spots here, so I'm going to redo this. <sighs> you know, it's all a learning experience. Anyway, I have to take my uh, cat to the vet with some shots, so I don't have a whole lot of time to do this right now. But, uh, this is the new one to felt, although it <laughs> has some paint on it because I put it on a while back. I took it back off. Bear with me. There we go. See, um, the hole has to line up. That's not the hole anyway. There it is. I need to find some screws. I don't have the original screws for this side. I do it for the passenger side. I've been using stuff like, kind of like that. I mean, it's a little long. This one's a little long. Sorry, I got the on the tripod. It's a little long, but I think it'll work. I don't know. I'm going to see if I can put those on right quick. After that, I'm going to go get ready. So, anyway. Anyway, uh, see you all later.